Vera Sidika is calling out friends who weren't able to attend Aziza Frisbee's funeral. As most of you know by now, Aziza sadly passed on about a week ago. She was mostly known as an Instagram model. She was close to online personalities like Vera Sidika, Rispa Faith, and Maxwell Mwamburi. Some allege that she was poisoned by a friend out of jealousy. Other reports allege that she died out of an overdose. This is what an article by Tuko said. An autopsy report showed the 28-year-old died from a drug overdose after a night of drinking with friends. According to her sister, who was also her roommate, they were drinking at their Kilalesho home, but she failed to wake up on Wednesday, October 4th morning. This is what Vera said after she passed on. I can promise you one thing, that girl star is too bright, they couldn't take it anymore. They had to finish her and we'll get to the bottom of this. Jealousy everywhere. I know for sure what that city has turned into. I can't trust nobody. Recently, Vera took to Instagram to express her frustrations with people who weren't able to attend the funeral. Friends especially, who were in Kenya but were not able to attend the funeral and went ahead to call all of them fake because they were not able to get to Tanzania within 24 hours. This is what she said. Saddest day of my life. I can't believe it. Everything happened so fast. Oh my God, we didn't even get to see you. So none of y'all will take a 1 hour 30 minute flight from Nairobi to Dar es Salaam to pay your last respects to a person you called a friend, knowing how Islam things move fast. This is why I say this world is filled with so many fake friends. It literally takes about 24 hours to fly from USA to Kenya. Everything happened so fast. OMG, I can't believe it. Your sister didn't even get to see you. I'm so heartbroken right now. She then tried to apologize for calling them out and said this. I won't judge. I totally understand that money could be an issue on impromptu trips. I apologize for that. But I'm just so devastated. If a close friend passes away and I'm a few hours away, I will try my best to make it. Atakama ni kukopa pesa, ni pande garibasi, or a group of friends hold hands, fuel a car and drive. It's just for hours. This is a special person. You'll never get to see her again. I'm so sorry I'm in my feelings right now, but just thinking being close to Tanzania should make it easier for people to go. A sister being far out in other countries and couldn't make it, me too, it's understandable, but Nairobi is just happy too. I don't know why I'm just so sad. I'm not okay. I'm ranting. I shouldn't. I'm sorry. I'm just not okay. I've never in my life lost someone close to me before. I don't know how to feel or act. There's a lot I could say, but I'll leave it at. I'll sleep over it. Maybe I'll I'll be in a better space tomorrow. Vera then deleted her profile picture.